I think what we need to do as a regulatory agency to try to bend the, bend the rate of new addiction is make sure that people who are being prescribed opioids are being prescribed them for a legitimate medical purpose. They, we know that if we can reduce overall exposure to opioids, we can also reduce the rate of addiction. It's simple math. Ah, that's the FDA Commissioner, Scott Gottlieb, talking there and on the need for innovation with the opioid crisis. Well, we've got innovation right here. Researchers are testing a vaccine to prevent opioid abuse. Dr. Mark Siegel is with us. Uh, what, what is the that heroin vaccine? Just explain what this is about. You know, I really love this idea. It's coming out of Walter Reed, okay. which is a great place for it to come out because a lot of our military have a problem with opioids. Okay. What this does is it uses antibodies to attack heroin or Percocet or Vicodin, anything like that that's an opioid. Literally, you make antibodies. So if it's in your bloodstream, Stuart, it can't get to the brain. It doesn't cause you to stop breathing, so you don't overdose, and you don't fe have the feeling, the euphoric feeling. Okay, so I'm, okay. I'm, I'm an opioid addict. I walk into the doctor's office, I get an inoculation, right? Absolutely. I get a jab in the arm. Absolutely. That makes the antibodies in my body uh, stop the opioid affecting my brain. That's it? It creates uh, antibodies that go right for that opioid, so heroin no longer works. Again, it no longer gives e you ever again. It doesn't, well, you may have to get a repeat of this. Okay, right now they're testing it. They test, they're starting to test it in humans. They're getting, they've got incredible results in animals. It looks very, very promising. So for people that are exposed to opioids and are at risk of addiction, you would use this. Yes, this but, but you, you walk away, the opioid doesn't work on you any longer. You don't get the buzz. What does the addict do? Well, the addict then would try to get it somewhere else. Obviously, if it's not working, you're not going to keep taking it. That's the whole idea. And also, you then could, I could then ru rush in with my antidotes, like Suboxone or Naloxone. So I would give the addict something that would help them physiologically get off of it. They wouldn't get the high anymore, and I would give them another medicine. This would probably, in my opinion, triple or quadruple the effect of the current therapies. This, this could be huge. Good. Got to be tested in, in, in human volunteers now. Okay, yeah, I now, you're not going to volunteer. No, you don't believe in vaccines. But this is one of the vaccines you would love. It's on the table. It's a long ways away, but it's very promising. And yes? Yes, very okay. promising. And manufacturers are going to come rushing in now. My prediction, this will get investors. This Excellent. is a big deal. Okay. Thank you, Doctor. Great idea, and too. Good news, too. We appreciate that. Thank you.